Okay, so you're accounting. Now, I'm still, still not done there. We're going to have a system for training your staff. How do you train your staff? Like, what is that, you know, what is the training system? Starbucks spends 15 hours training baristas how to become a barista. But most of all businesses spend zero hours training people how to do whatever. So we're going to have a training system. Okay, the actual process, how do we train people? A couple other areas we want to focus on. These are big ones. Your PR, which we're going to talk about today. Public relations. You know, how do you tell the media you exist? How a quick do you, question. Yeah. Um, on the training part, um, the, the training is a process in itself. Yeah. Right? So, I mean, when I have a guy that I'm training to do what, I, what we do, uh, it needs to be a written process. Mm -hmm that I give him a hard copy of and say, this is the way we do it. But in the training part of it, I'm taking him out and actually showing him how we do it. Let me just show you an example of what a process might look like for training. Um, what's, a what's a task that if I were to come work for you tomorrow that I need to be able to do? What's a process? Install a window. Cool. So install a window. Okay. So walk me through real quick. What's, what's kind of like the first thing I have to know how to do? Uh, how to talk to my customer. Okay. So, but how to talk to customer. When you show up at the job site, you greet the customer. Okay, so here's what you do is, one, how to, read, how to talk to customer, you need to check, I need to check off that I read it. Right. Two, I need to watch it. That's you doing it. Cool? Right. Three, I need to test off that I did it. Okay. So I demonstrated it, I'll put demonstrate. So let's review. Here we go. How to talk to a customer. Clay, read this packet. And I'm like, I don't really do a lot of reading very well. Hey, you need to, because that's a value of ours. We have a process for everything. So read it. So I read it. I come back. I say, I, I can do it, boss. And you say, okay, cool. Well, I'm going to have you watch me do it one time. Okay. So I go out and do it. Then I say, Clay, I'm going to this next customer. I want you to do it. I'll be there with you, but I want you to do it. I'm going to watch you. Well, it makes me nervous when you're there, boss. I know. That's why I'm there. So go ahead and do it. I do it, and I say, hi, my name's Clay. And you're going, what was that? Why were you singing to them while talking? We get back in the truck. You say, hey, what was that? And I say, I, got, I froze, man. I froze. And you're like, well, I can't sign off yet. Tomorrow, you're doing it again. And even though you could do it better yourself, you still want to make me do it until I've demonstrated mastery. Once I do, you check it off. Boom, on to the next thing. So you need to have every part of your business like that. That way, that there's so many businesses. This is what this is what like ninety percent of all businesses on the planet do. It drives me nuts. Is they do, they'll tell someone how to do it verbally. They never have the person demonstrate it, and almost they never shadow them doing it. So you know, let's just say I'm a hair salon. This is what I'll do. I'll hire a guy. I'll say this is how you do it, guy, and then I'll say, all right, you're starting on the floor. And then an hour later, I'm like, God, this person doesn't have the skills. No, what we need to do is say, hey, guy, this is how we do it. Read it. Now we're going to watch me do it, and now I'm going to shadow you doing it. And this is how we do it. Okay? This whole process is big. Think about this. Lee Cockrell, the guy who ran Disney World, one of our Thrive Mentors, 43,000 employees at Disney all have to learn core tasks. You can't do that verbally. You know, there's a reason the Bible's written down. We need to write it down. Okay? So, so PR is a big one. Now, the final one that's kind of a big just, and there's a lot of, I mean, there's endless areas we could do, but this is just kind of the big thing. We need to think about our billing process because in the world of contracting and, and there's just a nightmare of billing. There seems to be like, well, I thought, I thought Ms. Thompson was going to pay. She wanted an invoice. Whatever. We want to have a documented system. And I'll help you through all this today, okay? So, but we want to document that. And if you ever get stuck, what does GOAT stand for? Greatest of all times. Greatest of all times. So let's think about this. If you're stuck, I get hit by a bus, whatever. What you could do is go boop, 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 boop. Call a guy in Cleveland. By the way, there's a company in Cleveland called Universal Windows Direct. These guys, uh, one of them is a high, I think one of them is a high school dropout and one's a college dropout. They do millions and millions and millions of dollars of win window installation. Up in Cleveland, I spoke to their group. You can call a guy like that and say, hey guy, I'd like to pay a thousand bucks to learn this thing. Or you find a guy locally who, who's awesome at it. Or you, you always want to be looking. On Thrive, we try to provide examples and detailed systems for you too. But whenever you're stuck, look for someone who's the best at it in the world and look at them.